Okay, we are back. We put this suit on. We still can't open the door to our balcony. Ryan, those birds are flying the same exact way they were the other day. Um, I have a feeling that we're dealing with some groundhog shenaniganry. Groundhog day. And no, 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 it, it's doing it again. Oh, it's, okay, yeah, I see what you're saying now. It's like it's just repeating a thing. Disk disk developers. Uh, no. Developers. No, I think I think that's a, that they did that on purpose. Okay. Oh, that's a dead person. Um, I liked her. She was nice. Never mind. Holy crap, she's hideous. What happened to her oh, face? It's time we spoke. My code name is January. You're not dreaming. What happened yesterday was real. If you want to know what's going on, first, you need to get out of your apartment building. What? You're not safe. Um. The way to the elevator. Oh. Okay. Off. No, no. Go back into the room and try and break uh, oh, yeah. the window. With Holy shit! That is um. Ugh. Rippy as balls. That's why it kept repeating. It's just a fucking hologram playing on loop. Ah, tricky. Oh, we were getting spied on. Good. You're in the simulation lab. Now get to the exit. I'll keep in contact. Okay, let's look for anything. Okay. February 22nd, 2035. It's 2035. This is three years after we supposedly woke up. Holy crap. Did they really keep us sedated for three years? That's cre creepy. Okay, uh, sleeping, wakes up, turns off alarm, checks transcribe on computer, various tasks. It doesn't mention any of my destroying my room. Wait, wait. Oh yeah, I was about to say. Isn't this literally all the stuff that we did? Um, I guess various tasks is like throw your you throwing the stuff in your room. What is this audio events? Prefer to run program for timing of audio events. No pigeon visuals have been disabled due to glitch on the render data. <laughs> External risks are fully taken into account when the decisions are made. The move to extend indefinitely was a direct request request from both Alex and Morgan. Sil uh no um Sylvan Bellamy to Elvin McCarty. Um Dr. Bellamy, at this point Morgan's exhaustion is inhibiting our ability to get any useful results. That's to say nothing of the long-term damage we're likely inflicting from the constant neuromod installation and removal. Tell me again why we've extended the testing indefinitely. Ah, oh, they've been doing this forever. Uh, a note about this morning. I know this morning's incident has left people shaken. To prevent unnecessary panic, please refrain from contacting people outside of our department. Stationwide announcement will be made shortly. In the meantime, Miss Elliser and her security team are on high alert and will field any requests you have. I know that some of you are worried about Dr. Bellamy. He's currently being treated in the trauma center and is in critical but stable condition. Thank you for your patience and dedication to this project. Okay, that dude was dead. That, his head was gone. Who? The Dr. Bellamy, which I assume is the guy who uh, drank from the coffee cup. Which, he drank from a coffee cup and it turned into a monster. So, I'm assuming that these things have the ability to uh, make themselves look like other things. Um, yeah. Uh, I've only watched, like, 
a little things off of the internet about it. I think they're called mimics. Is what those little spidery things are called. So you have to be careful about every possible object uh, you see in this game. This is so creepy. But that's so messed up that they they've been making you repeat the same day for th three years, maybe even longer than that. There's a lot of wires and shit, which is nice. Hey, there's a, there's a shit ton of wine. Oh. Ha, like I'm dumb. Ah, I knew you was hiding. <laughs> Type an organ. Mimic? Type, type, yeah, that's what they're, they're called mimics. You even said they were called mimics. Yeah, well, why can't you take the tumor thing from it? I assume that it's related to some sort of skill. Maybe. Because um, it said, like, science something next to it. Can you... Oh. Okay, yeah, then maybe that that's it. I was thinking that our inventory was full or something. What the oh, so this is why... The doors rotate. So everything about the entire thing that we just did the Hephaestus hefty was a twist fabrication. And loop handle wrench is a standard issue for all per maintenance personnel employed in Transstar facilities. Good for liberal application of percussive maintenance and mechanical agitation. Use M1 to swing your wrench. Important. Press and hold 1 to charge up your attack for maximum damage. All wrench attacks will drain your stamina. So I have a question. You said that we were going to outer space. In a week, he promised. So it's we're, three we're, years we're from then. We're in space. This is all happening on some sort of spaceship, I bet. That's terrible that they're just doing this to this guy. Stop filming me! Debriefing safe. Okay. I guess we'll have to find the. My method is foolproof, Ryan. Just give me, like, Three hours. One eternity later. Damn it! I was sure that was gonna work that time. I I think we should probably move on. It's, it's been. I don't even remember. At least as long as this guy's been here. That's a that's a while. Right. That is really weird. Password um, ICOP0876. Well, that's just bad things. Alright. Uh, this is a friendly reminder from the relevant portion of the. Uh, how do we get out of this without doing that? Good. Do not share your password with anyone. Passwords are sensitive confidential information. Yeah, don't put them on the freaking thing anyway. Do not write your password down and store them anywhere in your office. If you suspect your password has been compromised, report it to IT users. Usual, we have responsibility for any attack activity that occurs on a workstation that has been compromised and not reported. Ah. Um, note, uh, Simmons, the test results today were all negative. Do you install the correct neuromod? Touch base with Graves and figure out what was wrong. This should be your absolute highest priority. A note about the morning. Um, I know this is the morning incident. Well, okay, yeah, we already read that. Um. Hmm. That looks positively that, medieval. Um, I'm pretty sure that's the neural mod thing that they've been using on us. Because hmm. look at it. It has a like a little scope thing that looks like it might be the eye thing that, that we read about earlier. Uh-huh. Oh! Huh. Sorry, Morgan. Not sure how you manage this, but I can't let you have this key card. Trust me, you'd regret it. Well... We found a secret. <laughs> Increases the battery life of the flashlight. Okay. I, I think I just found, like, a whole bunch of stuff that I wasn't supposed to find. Okay. Uh, med kit. Take that. Glossus. Disrupt your stun gun. Definitely a good thing. Okay. 
The Destructor Stun Gun will knock out human targets. Typhons are more resistant, but can still be temporarily stunned. Robotic devices will also be temporarily disabled and ultimately destroyed by the Destructor. Um, hold mouse one to charge your gun and release to fire. Use R to reload. So Typhons, are those what the mimic things are supposed to be? Um, I believe that's what they're referred to. Did you hear that? Maybe we need some sort of power. Oh, I thought that would have disabled it. Nah. Don't waste all your bullets. <laughs> <laughs> Found it. That's so crazy how they like could replicate all that stuff to make us think that it was all real. <laughs> -na 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 Batman. Batman Crawling around the pipes. Hitting people with a wrench. Batman! <laughs> Uh, let's try and go inside the trans star. Okay. Seems there. like those are glitching out. Uh, I would say looking around. Well, I want to know is why why are they doing this to us? Like, what what about our character makes all of this worth doing? Wait, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Test manager to reset the test rooms. Reset. Okay, so this is what? where the test is. I think we can handle it with with our wrench for now. Try and not use the, the thing. Everyone calls them mimics. Be careful what you pick up. Kickback. Yeah, let's try and conserve ammo as much as we can until we come across something a bit more deadly. <laughs> uh, where's my sexy robot? I think the Mimic might have gotten her. Or maybe the Mimic was her the whole time! Dun dun dun! I would be so upset he's spaghetti. Morgan's behavior. Alex has requested all orders go through him after Morgan's outburst at the debrief, pending a psych evaluation. Alex indicated he doesn't want any more surprises from Morgan, nor do we. Granted, Morgan had forgotten everything from the last test as expected, but the aggressive response to the same set of testing criteria was clearly a departure. My recommendation is we need to start charting personality. Drift before future tests and debriefings and within the test itself. So I was starting to show signs of aggression. Mm, makes makes sense. sense. I yeah. mean, you were throwing chairs at them. <laughs> so. I wonder if you actually tried doing the tests without, like, being aggressive. Alex. So that was a thing. What's going on? We have a problem. What about Morgan? He's alive. Sedated. Clean it up. I'm on my way. Got it. Hmm. That's the recording we heard earlier. <clears throat> this is pretty creepy. Yeah. What I want to know is, where did everyone go? Because uh, those dead. little, well, those no! little mimic things don't 
those little mimic things don't really seem that particularly dangerous. Well, maybe not, like, right away. <laughs> I guess if there was a giant swarm of them, then yeah, they probably would be pretty bad. Oh, I have a surprise attack a mimicked item. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, why is that coffee cup jumping? Is it glitching? See, this is fucked up. Because the developers know you'll be thinking, oh, there's stuff glitching in the game. Nope, it's a mimic. Not That's... Cool developers. This is very interesting, but I like that. Yeah, it keeps you on your toes. Alright, so... Well, in your case, it just makes you want to smash everything you see. I mean, I just... I want to smash, right? Becky, let me smash. N no, Aaron. Uh, his life bar should be going down, I think. Does it just eat his face? Uh, no, it fucked his face. And then it turned into four. No one has been uh -huh. able to stop the mimics from multiplying since they broke containment. I'm going to help you stay alive. Just a little further. Search his corpse. Ugh. Baseball gloves, spare parts. Requiesce, Scott Depache. You won't really be missed, random NPC that we met for like two seconds. of everything I know right urgent hey I think Bellamy's taken data related to mimicry um, and remote manipulation out of the research department get to the trauma center and grab the keyboard to his cabin off of his body um, I'm sorry to be morbid but Alex will lose his shit if someone else finds the data play your way spirit with different approaches to come overcome off ch challenges damn it and enemies, you can get past the locked door by searching for the key card or finding an alternate path. Uh, as you learn new abilities, more options will become available to you. That's cool. Harvest. Okay. Stand up notes. Reorder tests. Lucia on observation. Flammability tests canceled indefinitely. Alex wants to greet Morgan before test. <laughs> Hey, come back here. Come back. I know your chair. You're very bad at hiding. Whoa! Or is it? Shut up, Brian. <laughs> You know, if these things are this easy to kill, I don't understand why more people don't just carry wrenches with them. Do they kill it? Um, I don't, I don't believe so. I think we just damaged it for now. Your guy grunts really weird when he's attacking. Can't tell if we're getting Ooh, hurt or if he's getting bullets. exhausted. Well, now, if only we had a 9mm. It says that uh, we're still at 100 health and 100 armor, so... I got a lemon peel. Simulation lab. 
There's more flowers. Break the thing. Personality drift test. Here are results for today's personality drift test. I'm seeing some drift over the last few trials compared with the previous test. This isn't the first time. I'll let Alex know. Most recent test is pasted below for reference. Um, push the fat man. Push the fat man. <laughs> um, daily test. Dr. Bellamy. At this point, Morgan's exhaustion is inhibiting our ability to give me useful results. Uh, okay, we already read that. Have my people been coming to you? Sil, yes, I've noticed the same thing. You know I can't divulge names, but there's definitely been a spike in staff from your department reporting instances of acute anxiety. It's actually much worse than the psychotronic staff. I'm taking to Kelstrup, talking to Kelstrup about mitigating some of the t stress there, but I'm concerned that there these are non-isolated incidents. I'm going to mention it to Alex at the next director's meeting. Matthias Cole. There was only four of these things, right? From what I remember, but that doesn't mean that there won't be more. Um, again, still not quite sure what makes it worth it to them to make these tests on us. It may just be our our brain specifically. Maybe. So I keep seeing these things that need us to use skills, but is there a way for us to unlock skills? I mean, I'm sure there is, and we'll get them later. Well, meaning more of like, get them now. Simulation question. Hi, Alice. I'll send you some white paper Alex and Morgan wrote. Here's the nutshell version for now. Gaining a new skill from a neuron works similar to the way your brain creates new memories. In fact, it's impossible for now to separate the changes that the mod makes from your normal memory for formation. So if I want to strip the neuromod that makes you play piano like Gustav Lettner, it'll reset your brain back to the moment before you first installed it. Ah, it's fucked up. I'm, I'm thinking that this actually might have some sort of mechanical purpose in the game, too. Mm. They wanted Morgan's mind pristine to receive the prototype neuromod. That means going way the hell back. Hence the apartment sim... Yes, are dedicated. User are dedicated to their science is all I can say. Hit me up for lunch later. This is making oh me okay. Like Morgan volunteered. So, from that piece of information, what I think is going on is because every time you get a new mod, your brain resets all your memories to the point right before you got the mod implanted. So if he got the first mod implanted. On the fifteenth of that year, type in anthrophantasmus. Keep moving. If he got the first mod implanted on that year, it might mess with his brain. If he doesn't keep thinking that it was that time of the year when he wakes up, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, I, that's what I was figuring. Oh man, this is. I don't like. I don't like what's happening. The noetic field. The noetic research, like all bold new ideas, has gone undergone a predictable pattern in the scientific community. First, skeptic critical of the idea since it violates conventional wisdom and the laws of science. Second, skeptics grudgingly concede the idea might be possible in some circumstances, but the evidence is weak. Third, the idea catches the attention of mainstream <coughs> research and more importantly, the public. Finally, oh, excuse me. The same skeptics who once laughed at the idea now claim that they thought of it first. recorder analysis. I think this might might be where we're getting our our skills from. Repair. We need a repair Can skill. Hold down the repair button until the repair is complete. Press Y. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I guess I do need to repair one before I can do that. Okay. Um, that's a thing. Dang it, stop. It's dark. I can't see you very well. There we go. At least they're not hurting you that bad. Blue. 9mm bullet, shotgun 
chainsaw, med kit, blue canister, blue cannon. Ooh, hey, babe. Oh, so that's what that stuff on the wall is. Blue cannon. A trans star glue cannon. Jelly foam latest organism obstructor disables and or immobilizes, immobilizes targets without harming them. Glue can extinguish flames and temporarily stop electric arcs. When hardened, glue can also be used as a climbable flat platform. Use mouse one to fire your glue cannon and press and hold mouse one to fire a continuous stream. So this is basically our climbing tool slash getting around tool. <clears throat> oh, hi, hi Natasha. Didn't expect you to be in here. Nope. It was a blown day. Morgan, there, in the foyer. Grab the neuromod you see in the display case. Normally it's a fake. But I swapped in a real one for you. The neuromods are critical. You won't survive oh, without using them to install new aptitudes. Careful. I've already updated your transcribe with the oh. list you requested. Take a look. The list I requested? When did I request anything? Die! Stop! Stop Yikes. Man, it is bouncing around so much for me on my screen, I can't really tell if you're winning or not. I won. Okay. I'm gonna... I'm gonna eat a thing. How do I... How do I eat food? Uh, try I for inventory. Alright, I'm crunk. Pull the lever, Crunk. Okay, you said there's something... There's a Neuromod over there. I'll go get it. Okay. In the glass case, in the glass case. Hopefully you're not gonna eat anything. Ah. We get our first power. Neuromod Yay. abilities. The Neuromod is a revolutionary <clears throat> Transtar invention that allows you to learn new skills and abilities. Press N to open your transcribe and navigate to the Atom section. I mean Neuromod section. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> What? <laughs> Bioshock. <laughs> oh. Scientists. Uh, your knowledge of medical practice increases the effectiveness of med kits to 150%. I would probably either get the hacking or the repair, since that seems to be what we've been needing the most. Level one security measures on computers. Well, I'm gonna look. Leverage. Lift heavy objects with ease and throw objects further. Thrown objects will damage enemies. Oh, nice. Oh, wait. There. Aaron, mm -hmm. that that uh, bulletin board that we found with the safe, mm -hmm. we needed leverage one for that. Hmm. Let me like, keep that in mind. Indicators and recyclers with spare parts. More security, conditioning. Increase your health to 115, your stamina to 105. Run, sneak, and climb, sprint to 5% faster. Okay, I am normally inclined to engineering. Um in games so I'm gonna go with the leverage one because we know there's something that we want to do with that and um, from all of us here at Taylor Nights Entertainment um, stab yourself in the eye I guess oh no please can we, can we not oh. Oh! Ow. that that looks really painful or doors with no power. Now, let's get you to the main lobby. Screw you, guy. I'm going to open it. Back a to the thing. All right, we'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, donate to Child's Play, and Game Changers. And from all of us here at Table Nights Entertainment, roll on.